Yeah, yeah. So uh Sexy Red responds to Joe Button's comments about Drake being around her. So, you know, if you don't know, everybody knows who Sexy Red is, bro. So if you don't know, you know, you just put in Sexy Red, bro. You see, got one of the songs jumping off the charts right now that get it sexy, you know what I'm saying? It's not my particular type of music, but you know, it gets it gets the people going. But uh, I'm gonna just let y'all see what she was. Well, I'm gonna play it back for y'all so y'all can hear what Joe Budden had to say, and then we'll just let you know what Sexy had to respond to. Totally, oh, I ain't respectfully okay, and I ain't it, defending. It sound you. like a that could rap at that level that gets paid off of yeah. everybody's deal. Trying to rap. That's what it sounds like. Yo, okay, first of all. That's what it sounds like. Okay, yeah, wait, hold on. To me, I'm not, I'm not arguing with none of you. Right. That. you I'm you not just, trying to debate. Real quick, real quick, real quick. You said this paid on somebody's deal. deal. Like it's part is, is this confirmed? Like, or this so, is just some inside that you say? Really, or you think he just likes being around sexy red that much? Like that. Is this speculation? or No. So basically, you know what I'm saying? Then sexy red had retweeted the whole thing and said, they so dumb. Um, you know, before I get into the comments or whatever, I'm gonna just, you know, no, no, I'm gonna let you know, get in the comments, let them see what they because they be popping off. So it says, How they mad? She's minding her business. Uh, sexy red is Drake's spirit animal. <laughs> Let's be honest, the fact that sexy red has latest this lasted this long and wasn't a number one hit one. Uh, Boy, what? I ain't gonna, boy, they be texting crazy on here. So, man, we need periods and comments. So, I don't need y'all be trying to talk about how somebody reading it in the comments and whatnot. But, uh, lasted this long. It wasn't a one hit wonder. It's social media and cloud. Cause there ain't no way this would have been a thing 15 years ago. So, we got, it's, uh, Look at all these EBT babies coming to Skank Red's defense. I got a lot of, it's a lot of women hating on Sexy Red in these comments, no? And then the boy dudes is, dudes is holding it down. Pause, they talking about, bro, she look like a fun-ass person to be around. And then, you know, women's like, why is this a topic? You know, I mean, to be honest, why is this a topic? You know what I'm saying? Kind of sound like, uh... Niggas is just on that couch hating Joe Budden. But um, what I say about it, I'm proud of my shit about it. I feel like, I'm not going to lie, I am in the demographic as far as I do not understand why they made her music so relevant to where it's just like I got to hear that shit all the time because the music is like A, B, C, D type shit. But, you know, it's not for me. But I can understand why the people who like her music get hyped for it. But them to think that Drake is part of her deal or whatever, that's why he around her all the time. So she can, you know, get that clout or whatever and get do numbers. I think that shit is a uh, – I think that boy Joe's out of pocket for that one because then it kind of makes it seem like you just disrespecting her grind. Like before she even – met Drake, she was she was already popping with the song that she had that my booty hole brown whatever type shit so so from him saying that just like nigga you hating on her come up you know what I'm saying cause she was popping before she started working with Drake and shit what's niggas act like you can't have, have girl best friends or what not that could just be like you know what I'm saying that's just what that is bro like to be cool as hell. A lot of these women is, are cool as hell. You know what I'm saying? But niggas that niggas mess that shit over because niggas be so pressed for trying to fuck or do something, you forget that this like this a cool ass individual might be one one of the realest ones that you ever have in your corner. So I mean I feel like he just an old nigga and he hating and he ain't never had no you can tell he ain't never had no woman as a friend. Every woman that he done had as a so supposedly friend, he done tried to fuck or ended up, you know what I'm saying? Because he, he he can't draw that line, so he don't see it. But um, 
what you think in the comments. Let us know what you think about it. You know, put it in the comments if you think think this is a cap. You think George is hating, or you think he got a point. You know what I'm saying? But uh, just whatever you do, just get in the comments though, and make sure you like and subscribe. You did.